Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley B. Deck, and today I've teamed up with YG Wigs to bring you this beautiful, super gorgeous green highlight lace wig. This is going to be a closure wig. It's going to be glueless, so it's going to be simple and easy and beginner friendly to install. I wore this for my son's basketball game today. I got compliments from the moms there. We went for yogurt at our local, like, town or like shopping center and I got random people talking about how cute my hair was I definitely got compliments and when I wear curly wigs straight wigs body waves bust down I don't care how bomb is installed I never get so many compliments as I did on this wig so this is definitely going to be my my birthday weekend so this definitely is going to be my weekend hair my son is turning eight this week we're going to universal great wolf lodge and some fun things so I'm thinking it, I'm probably gonna wear this one because this will be cute like in mario kart world what do you guys think anyways i'm gonna go ahead and jump right into the tutorial be sure to check the description box for a direct link to this beauty here also subscribe if you haven't already now let's get into it okay babies happy sunday it is sunday um april 23rd we are five days away from my baby's eighth birthday i can't believe i almost have an eight year old um, speaking of my baby, it is 1.33 in the afternoon and his basketball game starts at 2. Um, and here I am just now getting ready. I got in and out of the shower really quickly. But YG Wigs sent me this beautiful wig. And forgive me, I'm combing it out because um, I opened it up and I tried it on when I first got it. My girls fell in love with it and they were running around the house saying, can we wear this? Um, but it's this beautiful, beautiful green highlight lace wig it's nice and long again i'm in a rush so i don't and you see it has a little bit of layer you see i'm holding the ends and you see the layer in the front um i'm on my way to my baby's game so i don't have time to review the specs on this one so i'm going to zoom through the install process this is what the inside construction of the cap looks like it is a closure wig it appears to be swiss lace and i haven't even looked at the um information they sent me i don't even know if you guys can see that you probably won't be able to see it but when the edges are really jagged like that you see how like pretty and jagged that means it's probably swiss lace um it is a closure wig which is why i'm confident that i can do it the yg wigs cap or tag is in the back i'm gonna just go ahead and make the straps each go to the center of the wig this is how you make it as tight as it should go it does have an adjustable elastic band inside as well and I'm also going to tighten this and I like these that have this because I like the bra strap ones too but this one you can get a little bit more of a tighter fit if your nape or your head is tighter um, I'm wearing an old wig cap these are wait this is an HD wig cap and I just buff uh, my foundation shade the Ruby Kisses is my favorite um, which I need to make a reminder to order some more, but I'm going to go ahead and put it on. I don't think this is as tight as it can go, but typically um, I put this on first. My braids are typically not as tight or flat as they can be. So I use the band to kind of like press those in and then I put the cap over and it's on. Now I thought it was going to be easy to put the cap on because I just assumed this was just going to be like a free for all type of wig, but it actually fits me snug. So we might be able to wear her glue this let's see oh yes look at the hairline it's pre-plucked thank the lord i was expecting to have a lot of work to do but it looks like i chose the right wig to have installed in 15 minutes because it seems to fit glueless so i'll be able to wear it bone straight and not just for finesse of a video but for actual real life situation wanted to show you the length you can't see it all the way, but you guys can see it's nice and full. It's not like a thin, you know, wig at all by any means. You get your length and you get your fullness. It has some layer in the front. So if you want to go ahead and like do some curls like this, it has a little bit of layer to it. I may do some later, but for now, we're just going to go ahead and rock her bone straight. Okay, so let's not waste any time. I've already went ahead and heated up the electric hot comb because you know we can't. It's not an Ashley V deck install if we did not um, do something with some heat. So this is a close-up look at the hairline. As you guys can see, it blends with my skin beautifully. This here is a great example of how it, like, it blends really good. And then it is also pre-plucked beautifully. So you have a closure wig, pre-plucked, bomb, lace, and it fits snug. So we might have to put a little bit of even just to... 
um, make it tacky. Look how beautiful that is. The girls in my yoga class are going to gag because they always see me with different hair. Okay, I messed up here, but again, I'm in a rush, so I have a little extra lace there. I don't have time to try to go back in with the um, eyebrow razor. That was the eyebrow razor that I used. Okay, so it does fit glueless. It fits 100% glueless, and I'm going to show you from the side. But I do want to melt it in. So I'm just going to add a little bit of even. And you see how you put a little bit of that? You can even use your finger. And just melt it and press it in. And then once it dries, you can lift it back up if you really wanted to just wear it glueless. Again, this is melting a melting spray as well as like a glueless adhesive. So... This is just going to make it tacky so that it looks super melted. And you guys know I just kind of like use a towel to um, get rid of any excess because I don't want it to have the product um, along the hairline on my skin is what I'm trying to say. Now let's go ahead and just make everything look super flawless. For this we're going to use my own personal product which is the wax stick from bedeckbeauty.com. This is the electric hot comb from my company, bedeckbeauty.com. I have it on 500 degrees. Now let's speed through because we're just about to go ahead and just make this as flat and as bomb as we can possibly get it. See the difference that made? It just looks more neat even though we're not done. The sun is going down now Been at it for a while And I have had enough And that looks bomb Now I want to do some baby hair But if the girls don't love baby hair I'm completely out of shapers But I figured there was just enough in there To add a little hold to the front Because I kind of want to do that little flip over like this To kind of like pronounce those Highlight green pieces and that kind of, the shapers adds the hold. So I'm going to just take a little bit of this Too Faced concealer. And I'm just going to go along the parting and I'm just going to make it a little bit pronounced. Now last time I did my makeup or my wig, I used the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation in my actual shade, which is like 360 Mocha or 360 Coconut, something like that. 362, 365, I don't know. Um, one of the darkest shades that are found in the store. Oh, here it is. 360 Mocha. Which, I think this is my shade. Um, and I actually liked the way that looks. It's a little bit more brown and not too pronounced. But we're still going to do the Too Faced today. And then I'm just going to take this shade or this foundation. And this one tends to be like... It looks close to my complexion, but when I put it on as a foundation, it gives me that casket fresh look. So I would say it's a shade maybe too darker than my complexion. And I'm just going to generously go along the hairline with this so that like it's a little bit more seamless. And I kind of push it against the hair as well. Now I really, 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 really want some baby hair like real bad. I don't necessarily have time to do the chase method for real, for real. Girls! You ready to go? You see how beautiful it is just to run a little bit of heat through it? This is what it looks like straight out of the box. Still cute, but let's make it match. Okay, so again, this one came from YG Wigs. I'm going to go ahead and head out to the basketball game. And then I'll come back for what we call the final show. Okay, ladies, we are done with the look. I went ahead and did my entire day with the family. Diamond had a basketball game. My husband is his coach. They won the game by, I think, either two points or four points. Either way it goes. It was almost about to be a tie, which means I think we would have went into overtime. But luckily, we didn't. Anyways, we celebrated. We went to Olive Garden, had some 
food. We haven't been to Olive Garden like in at least two years, maybe even three years. It's been so long. So um, it was nice to have a little bit of yummy, yummy, yummy fam family time. You guys already know YG Wigs is like a staple on this channel. This is a household name and I love this company. You guys know you can check my channel and I have so many. I would guess at least like five to ten I had to guess maybe like 10 to 12 including this video uh, videos with this company but this is the bag that the wig was in and then that little clear uh, bag inside was the 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 first bag that the wig was in then on top of that it was in the little mesh bag also inside they gave us this little goodie pack you know we love some free booties and inside we do have pack wig caps rat tail comb in black purple baby hairbrush and then two little clips and they're kind of like, I don't know if it's called a holographic or like this kind of gives you like tortoise and this is like a, maybe like a cobalt, cobalt blue, electric blue, maybe super cute little clips. And yeah, like I said, I got compliments on this hair. Um, I already knew it was cute. I knew it was going to be a vibe. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out YG Wigs. All the specs on this one as well as a direct link are in the description box. Again, thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches!